Attempts by the United States, Canada and a few other countries to smear the human rights situation in China were once again defeated as a majority of United Nations member states voiced support for China. At Monday's meeting of the Third Committee of the 77th Session of the UN General Assembly, Cuba's representative delivered a joint statement on behalf of 66 countries in resolute support of China. The statement stressed that Xinjiang, Hong Kong and Tibet-related issues are China's internal affairs, and opposed politicization of human rights and double standards, or interference in China's internal affairs under the pretext of human rights. Meanwhile, in a joint statement on Monday in support of China on behalf of six Gulf states, as well as Yemen and Libya, Saudi Arabia's representative emphasized the objective, constructive and non-political principle on human rights issues, calling upon all states to follow the purposes and principles of the UN Charter and the Universal Declaration of Human Rights, and to respect national sovereignty and non-interference in internal affairs. Reinforcing the momentum in support of China, Venezuela's representative delivered a joint statement on behalf of 19 members of the Group of Friends in defense of the Charter of the United Nations, criticizing that some governments have been unable to fully guarantee the right to non-discrimination against their own citizens, while illegally imposing unilateral coercive measures, which has become a modern form of systematic discrimination. During the meeting, many other countries expressed support for China in their national statements. 不僅盟運動代表120多個發展中國家在三維發言,明確反對選擇性、政治性、化作法,反對針對發展中國家的國別人權機制和決議,俗世所非,一目了然,人心向背,一清二楚,但少數政客熱衷於口號治國,打著人